Hello guys, in previous session we learn options with scaffold in Infium Laravel generator. Today we are going to learn more options with scaffold using Infium Laravel generator. So let's check. Here is the list of all options. Today we are going to learn six options with scaffold. First one is Cedar. Second one is field from file, custom table name, generate from table, skip generation file, custom primary key name. So today we are going to learn those six options. So Laravel Infium generator provides seeder option. If you want to seeder for seed some data, you need to just pass dash dash seeder option into command for generate seeder file. Let's take one example with seeder option. PSP artisan infium colon scaffold here you need to specify model name let's we take example of news cedar we need to specify field name here first field is a title database type is a string and HTML type is a text title is a required so required field so we need to specify in validation second field is a description HTML type database type is a text and HTML type is a text area exit let's run migration you can see here all file are generated also you can check cedar file as well created let's see news table cedar dot psp created also main cedar file is updated let's check code database seed directory you can see here news table seeder file created and database seeder also updated news table seeder so if you want to seed some news data you need to write your logic here let's check second option field from file so we are generating scaffold using command line but if you want to um, generate a scaffold um, from file you can do it uh, if you have a schema file then it can be used with generator rather than entering schema from console you can find a sample file at vendor let's find it at possible option you need to pass dash dash field file with a relative path let's find sample find vendor find infium labs laravel generator samples field sample dot json so you need to create your schema file like this sample so let's take one example i have already member dot json schema file so let's try with this json file psp artisan infium colon scaffold 
specify model name here I have specify member uh, dash dash fields file equal to you need to specify full path of your schema file so I specify full path of member dot json file let take you can check all file generated and json already exist if you want to overwrite then you specify yes and if you want to run migration you need to specify yes so you no need to specify all fields in console if you have file let's take third option custom table name so lara in pm laravel generator provide custom table name support also uh, basically when you generating a scaffold generator take table name uh, from model name but if you need to different table name you can do it with generator and you need to specify uh, custom table name with a dash dash table name option so let's take one example PSP artisan in PM scaffold let's take visitor as a model name and specify table name traveler first name database type is string html type is text field is required last name is second field database type is string html type is text last name is required email string html type is a email email is not required exit the process run migration everything is generated let's check in code let's check migration first you can check we created um, scaffold of visitor and specify table name is a traveler so migration created with traveler name let's check model you can check here visitor is a model but table name is a traveler so you can specify your own custom table name with infium laravel generator so let's check another option generator from table generate from table means you can uh, uh, generate a scaffold from your existing table so you need to uh, specify from table option with table name so you no need to specify fields uh, or anything so let's try to generate uh, one scaffold from existing table laravel provide user uh, table default so let's try to generate it this this from table 
you need to specify a table name users n is capital let's try to generate you can check user.php repository factory request controller and all files are generated from database let's check in code let's check in view resource in view all users file here so let's uh, check one more option skip generation file so infium laravel generator also give the flexibility of choose what you want to generate and what you want to skip you can specify skip option file which will not be generated so let's take a example psp artisan in film scaffold category skip test name string text required and exit yes let's check test is skipped or not so you can check here model repository request ev controller everything created but test file not created so you can skip um, any file with skip option let take one more options custom primary key so in film laravel generator support custom primary key name by default generator take the primary key is id field but it gives you flexibility to use your uh, own primary field you need to specify field name with dash dash primary option so let's take one example php artisan in pom scaffold tag primary tag id tag name database type string html type text let's exit the process run migration you can check all file are generated here so let's check code you can check increment as a tag id and other table increment as a id so let's check model in this model we cannot see any primary key but in tag model primary key specified as a tag id so in other model 
id is a primary key and it take default so thank you for watching the video uh, please do not forget to subscribe my channel thank you